Do you want safety, prosperity, and all the Sabine women you can handle? Then you want Romulus for your king. Romulus is the son of Mars and the stepson of the god of the Tiber River, and is a man with the heart of a god and the body of Hercules. Romulus will destroy all neighboring enemies, build defenses on the Palatine Hill, provide jobs to the poor and downtrodden, put on harvest festivals that will make even Ceres, the goddess of the harvest, quiver with delight. And he plans to take 600 Sabine women at sword point for wives and mothers of Rome. Some may tell you that Remus should be king, but those people seek the downfall of civilization. Remus will plunder the people of their wealth, just as he selfishly tried to plunder and steal the teat of his wolf mother from Romulus when they were suckling babes. If Remus is king, fire, rape, murder, and incest will be the orders of the day, and he will name the city Reem. Others say that Aeneas should be their king, but who wants a king who lost in warfare at Troy to the dirty Greeks? Women, guard your loins, for Aeneas will plunder your honor, then leave you for another land, leaving no other option but suicide. Just ask his former lover, Dido. When you choose your founder, choose wisely. Rome can have no other king but Romulus. Romulus for king, 753. I am Romulus, and I approve this message. <laughs>